It's that time of the year when it seems everyone is going on a diet, right? But it can be short-lived. By the end of last year, only 15% of those surveyed by Consumer Reports National Research Center said they were still on a diet. And 40% said they usually just ate whatever they wanted. We're taking action for your health tonight by showing you why we may be failing. Most people characterize their diet over the past year as pretty healthy, according to a Consumer Reports poll. But delve deeper into the survey's findings, and it seems we may be fooling ourselves. We asked people what steps they're taking to eat well and control their weight. It turns out that only 15% are counting calories, which is actually a key strategy for losing weight. In fact, the poll found most people don't have an accurate take on calorie counting. We asked people which had more calories, a Dunkin' Donuts glazed donut or a Dunkin' Donuts plain bagel. 75% got it wrong. The donut actually has 260 calories. The bagel, 320 calories. Are there more calories in 20 M&Ms or an ounce of pretzel sticks? 20 M&Ms? 20 M&Ms. M&Ms. &M. Actually, the M&Ms have 68 calories. That ounce of pretzel sticks, 100 calories. Even people who describe themselves in our poll as watching what they eat, didn't necessarily make good choices. About 30% who say they carefully limit sugar down a sugar-sweetened drink most days. And 10% who say they strictly limit their fat had bacon or another fatty meat for breakfast. But the good news, nearly 60% of those polled said they eat five or more servings of fruits and vegetables a day. And they're choosing whole grains instead of white bread and white rice. Consumer Reports survey also found that 78% of Americans eat breakfast, and that's another important finding because eating breakfast has been shown to keep your weight under control.